Welcome to Musher's Tales. So it's March break. We're gonna go couple cut a tree around the pond that's dead. There's a bunch of them and then uh, we're gonna torch it. We're gonna have a little bonfire. So I got a couple of helpers here. And we're off. It's sheer ice everywhere so you gotta be careful walking. See you by the tree. Somebody, we won't say who, didn't check the gas on their bike before they left. So, uh, make, wait, okay. You always make sure this thing here is pointed towards the top so the air's going in. Okay, be careful. Put it in the hole. There you go, okay. <laughs> you know what you didn't do, eh? On the other. Here. Yeah. <laughs> Pull this. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I guess you don't tank too much gas, eh? Here you go. Back you go. <laughs> it happens. <laughs> Not to me. Not to anybody I know, but. <laughs> uh, I'm glad I got that on video. Your dad's going to laugh. And your mom won't know why you're laughing. Give it a second. Well, there's a lot of dead trees here. There's a lot of helpers over here. So we're gonna go cut one. The one that's leaning over the water the most. And we'll cut it down. Then we'll haul it out. All these rocks here, because people were throwing rocks yesterday. You're gonna walk, don't walk in the middle, eh, buddy? You stay behind me. See how the deer was sinking a bit? Okay, so whoop. Here we go. So. Timber. So the ice didn't break, so uh, if the ice didn't break, it means it should hold us. Watch out, because it's going to be real slippery. Yeah, I don't. Anyways, we'll have to have a look. I'll have a look when I take the limbs off.
Okay, and look, the wind's coming from my back towards you. So the flames are going your way. So it might be an idea if you come around this side and throw it on the fire. Because your mom wouldn't be happy if you go home with some burns in your coat. Right, mom? Whoa. All these dead trees are because uh, a beaver moved in and I let him live here and <laughs> raise a family. And uh, look at the mess. That's why all those trees are dead. That's why. And then the beaver moved off. <laughs> Once he'd eaten all the food, he moved away. He never even tried to catch them, never caught them. He just came here, raised hell, and took off. Kill all the hardwood, drown all the softwood. So, uh, my grandson wants me to cut down a tree right here, this dead one here, but I'm not going to do it because it's the bark, it's a birch, and there's lots of uh, bark on it still, so the, the birds are going to pick the insects. So, here we go. Yeah, we could have a few of those bonfires. So, thanks a lot, Mr. Beaver. No, and I wouldn't go crazy because when the snow melts, it's going to fall. Yeah, so that's why. So I just get it off the road and uh, I wouldn't do much more. Because it's for sure it's going to fall. So that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Till the next time. Okay, walk towards me. Don't cut there because that'll be the thinnest part. There you go. Smile.